Hello there. We are back today with another reaction. And today is a great day because the homie Nick and the homie Andy just dropped new Termina. The brand new song, The Edge of Time. Now, the last song they put out, Desolate Spectre, uh, went more like a deathcore kind of route. And I remember Nick talking about this song being like a combination of the three singles that they put out prior to this. So, um, assuming that is the case, that we should be getting a treat right here, alright? Um, if you enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like, comment below what song I should react to in the future, subscribe if you've not done so already, and grab that bell, put your cat soon on to be notified for every single time I upload a video on this channel. Alright, with that out of the way, what do you got in store for me today, man? I'm ready. I like the Zelda font. Almost has like a humanity's last breath tone. Ooh! Andy with those fast vocals, man. Ooh, love that vocal melody. Love that bass in the background right there. I love that tapping beat in the background right there. Back to that amazing chorus. Different beat in the background. How long has you been streaming, screaming that? All right. <laughs> what? Terminal Dysphoria out April 9th. Ooh. Alright. Gonna pre order that later today. So there was Termina, The Edge of Time.
that that was that was crazy that <laughs> I mess with this that I think this is probably my favorite single uh like I f like what Nick said about this like combining the three singles into one and like like one style I guess was kind of what is we were saying I I don't know, but that kind of thing I did really feel like was what was going on uh, with this, um, like with like the uh, I don't know, but yeah, it it really felt like they were meshing like Lucid Abyss and Desolate together, um, and they did it really well. Um, yeah, that that. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna get PTSD from that breakdown, but, uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> so, alright, let's, uh, let's get into it. So, guitar work, I thought was really, really good. Um, I liked the different riffs that, uh, Nick chose for this. Um, and then, like, also the lead work was really good as well. Um, like, in that, in the chorus, and then the, uh, what other parts were there? Uh, there, I noticed there was like a tapping lead um, in the in the second verse, which I thought was really cool. Um, bass, um, I know Nick programs the bass for this, but I really liked what he did um, in that post-chorus section, um, where um, it, he was like kind of just like it, it was really like lo-fi, but like. And, like, it was really hard to hear, but, I mean, it's, I think it fit really well in there, especially with the volume it had um, with uh, with the rest of that part. Um, and then drum work, I thought, was also really good. The, uh, the, the drum melodies and everything really fit the song. Um, Andy. My man just unleashed the beast right here. Um, yeah, the yeah vocals were absolutely amazing. Um, I love the uh, I love the aggression um, in not only the verses um, but um, even the the chorus, where it was more like a kind of a poppy melody. It's you could still kind of feel the aggression of the of the cleans. Um, and then that's that last chorus where he, uh, did that, scr that really long scream to end out that chorus, I thought it was really cool. Um, overall structure, I thought it flowed really, really well together. Um, the, the verses, uh, really fit the rest of everything and it really like helped build up for those choruses. Um, Yeah. <laughs> And then <laughs> that that breakdown is that that shook me a little bit. Um, yeah, I mean, like I know, like Nick t Nick teased this quite a bit, um, and I know, like he streamed like uh, recording this song on Twitch. So, um, but yeah, like the final mix of this, I thought was really really well done. Um, yeah, and then. Yeah, that, that guttural that Andy did at the end of that breakdown was crazy. Like, I don't... How does this man do it? <laughs> um, yeah. So, overall... Do I give it to him? Or... Ten out of ten. I gotta give it to you. I gotta give it to you guys, man. That was phenomenal. I'm so excited for this new album, um, April 9th, twenty twenty one. I really hope there's more stuff like this um, on the rest of the album, because um, this right here has potential to be. This is definitely in my in my top three songs that I've heard this year. Just yeah, it's it's extremely well done. Yeah. Um, so yeah, 10 out of 10. 
uh, I don't think there's anything else for me to say. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this song, I'll leave a link to the original video down below. Please, I am begging you, go show Nick and Andy the love. Um, their new, uh, as you can see on the screen, new album Dysfor Dysphoria out April 9th. Um, <clears throat> so go pre-order that album, go buy their merch, do everything that they have. Um, yeah, go follow them on social media, everything. Um, and then if you like this video, be sure to leave a like. Comment below what song I should react to in the future. Subscribe if you've not done so already and grab that bell. Put your cat soon on to be notified for every single time I upload a video on this channel. Also been streaming on Twitch lately, twitch.tv slash condorxt. Link is in the description below and uh, you should probably see it on the screen right about now. Uh, yeah, thank you for watching. I will see you in a future video. Sayonara.